I've been quite fascinated by this one particular stock. I only want to focus on one that I believe can go up 10 times, and that is Pinterest. In this era where people are fighting with each other on Facebook and Twitter, it's just a toxic environment, I decided to explore Pinterest, and it's kind of a fascinating thing. It's a, Pinterest is a social media app, but it's based around pictures, but in a different way than Instagram. It's kind of like to give people inspiration for ideas. Like a lot of, it's basically women who are under 35 are using Pinterest, and that's an incredibly important demographic group. They have a lot of money to spend. They really uh, will react well to things related to beauty products, especially. And I think it's integrated into Shopify. I was playing around with it today, and I was noticing hmm, there's a lot of things you could click on this or that. And you can get an option to uh, go to some Shopify store and uh, directly buy their products. That's why I'm invested in Pinterest. But not only that, I looked at their earnings. Their earnings are through the roof, like 200% on the uh, in terms of the uh, earnings from the prior quarter. That's pretty dramatic. Now the return on equity, I believe that's only around like. Uh, 14 or 15 percent that could improve I believe over time that probably will improve but what I like about this company is that it actually still seems to be in its infancy I haven't really even talked I've, I've used the Pinterest since the beginning because I'm always curious about these social media apps when they start but I really have lately been quite uh, impressed by this because I feel that there is going to be a stampede of a lot of people away from Facebook and away from Twitter because neither of them are really catering to to what people want. Some of these uh, companies are acting too much like a government. They, they think that they know what's best for people. But Pinterest is actually offering people something that they actually want. They search for whatever it is they want, beauty products or makeup ideas, hair ideas, whatever. And this uh, Pinterest actually delivers it with uh, very com compelling and interesting pictures and what I also like about it is that it's not really a toxic environment on Pinterest so I don't think that people will start to uh, lose interest in Pinterest or or find it boring or, or tiring like like Facebook Facebook is just nobody likes Facebook anymore Facebook is done <laughs> but in terms of the chart Pinterest looks really really great I think that uh, considering it went public, I think, 2019, but it does look like one of those uh, one of those companies that could go up 10 times. Uh, what would what would cause that? Well, it has already grown a lot with just basically women and millennials. But what if they figure out a way to expand this audience? What if they make like a make Pinterest that that is compelling more for men too, or for an older demographic and a younger demographic? They're really good at this core demographic which is great but I think over time that they may indeed expand their offerings which will be pretty cool uh, but I really like something that's new and exciting Facebook is not new Twitter is not new and not only that both of them seem to have uh, really are where people have the most problems like Twitter is just a, a nobody likes being on there it's not a fun environment I don't think people like the fact that everybody's rude on there. And on Facebook, it gets old. The, you get the baby pictures and the, the cat photos and videos that people post that gets pretty boring pretty fast. Whereas I think Pinterest is uh, more focused on what people want because you're searching for, usually you're searching for what uh, kind of images you want to see. You could, uh, it does actually use algorithms to automatically show you pictures or GIFs or links to videos just based upon what you've done in the past but I think what's cool about it is it has a very good algorithm when you search for things it actually is pretty good at finding it so this is a company I do believe can go up 10 times now you should always do your own research if you lose money that's the way the market works so don't uh, don't complain to me you should do your own diligence first it's just a random commentary on the internet it's not investment advice anyway I hope this, you like this video, click subscribe, and also like, it definitely helps with the Google algorithm when you click the like button, so I'll see you in the next video.